Welcome back to a very tense this morning kitchen where Phil Vickery is waiting to find out if he's making jam roly poly or Arctic rule. The poll is closed. The votes have been counted and verified. The results are <laughs> in. Over 11,000 people have voted. There is only two votes in it in the battle of Britain's best retro desserts. I can now reveal the winner is... The Arctic Roll! <laughs> 11,000 votes. Oh, oh, 62 <gasps> votes in it. I thought, yeah. it was two, I thought it was our two votes for Arctic Roll. What should have voted? So they've spoken. Phil. Yes. Arctic oh, Roll. Right choice, do you reckon? I don't really mind, actually, to be honest with you. Don't mind. We'll do it another time. All anyway, right. here it is. Here yes. it is. Look at this. So, Ooh. very simple, but it's one of these things which, when you, when you play around with it, yep. there's a little bit of technical stuff you have to understand for you to get right. Mm. Okay, just to, if people don't know what an Arctic Roll is, can you just. just... Yeah, Arctic Roll is sponge, jam, and ice cream. Mm. That's, That's it. And, and I, when I was a young boy, that was your treat on a Sunday night. Dream yeah. trio. Yeah. Anyway, so we'll, we'll ditch this part. This, is, this, is, this can all go <laughs> somewhere. Else. Okay. Now, the, the, the key to this is the sponge, okay? And, and it, it's what we call a genoa sponge, which is a, a light sponge. So rather than creaming butter and sugar together, mm. you whisk four eggs and 70 grams of sugar until you get a nice light. Mm -hmm. Oh, I do talk to me in French again. Well, my brother would say, it's a phone. Seven <laughs> <laughs> a phone. A phone. It's, it's a phone. So you don't have to go too mad because what you don't want is to be too airy. Okay. Because it's a very thin sponge around the outside. Because you've got to be able to wrap it. That's exactly. The, that's the key, isn't Without it? Without it crack. cracking. Yes. Right. Well, we'll come on to that in a second. Okay. So if you whisk it too fast, it's like a, it's like a souffle. It will crack. Right. It's okay. too much air. Okay. So that, at that point there, which is just hold its own weight roughly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Then I add 35 grams of plain flour. Mm hmm. 35 grams of corn flour. Did you sieve those? I did indeed. OK. Now, there's a reason, obviously, get you. She's such a swat when it comes to this stuff, honestly. This is what I'm getting to learn. <laughs> I'm deeply impressed. She, she, <laughs> cool. you're gonna have to get like you, to know. You're going to have to get used to this. She has a lot to say about the cooking. Does she? But you love it. You love it, to be fair. I she's do. A great, I like making she's a great stuff. Cook. Everyone can cook. Let me tell you that. It's very easy. <laughs> now, <laughs> now, the thing about this is, you, what you don't want to do is take the air out, but also, consequently, you don't want to get it... Too light, as it will crack. Yeah. So what I do is I start just letting that flour and corn flour fall through the so whisk, filtering mm -hmm. it through. Is that like so that you're just trying to get rid of the lumps? Is that the idea? Yeah, exactly. They'll just come out anyway. That's fine. Mm -hmm. They'll cook out anyway. But when that's nearly incorporated, mm -hmm. then I add 70 grams of butter. Mm -hmm. Now this adds to that sort of plast, sort of plastic, plast plasticity. Plasticity. Thank oh, you very much. That's uh -huh. what I'm here. Yeah, but if you add that too earlier on becomes very heavy. Right, OK. So what I do, and I'm, this is a very professional way of doing it, but we used to, as a, I was taught as a young chef, that you can't use a whisk. You have to, at the last part, just let that fall through your fingers. Ooh. Oh. Why? 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 Because yeah. that, that's the only way of incorporating it properly. You can see the butter there. My hands are clean, don't worry. Is it the warmth of your skin as no, well? No, it's or purely it... just so you can feel it and you can just oh, feel okay, it incorporating. Okay, okay. And you don't get that with a whisk. Oh, okay. You really don't. And then that's So you can see how loose that is and see the butter is yes, nearly yeah, incorporated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you don't do it, it's underneath. Okay. Well, my boys would love doing that. Oh, it's great. It's like yeah. making slime That's why you've got your white potions. tree trousers on, isn't it? <laughs> that's fine. See? Then here I've got a Swiss roll tray. We just pour that in. Let it all go in. Mm -hmm. Okay. And again, you'll see this all in care. There's a little bit of butter there, see that? Mm -hmm. Don't worry yeah. that too much. Mm -hmm. But that's all right, is it? That's fine. What you want is that elasticity to the sponge. Right. And the, and the cornflour gives that as well. Okay. Just let it run out. 190 degrees, mm -hmm. between 15 and 18 minutes. Right. Okay. Okay. I think it's slightly different on the recipe. Depends on if you're oven calibrated or not. OK, yeah, yeah, well, oh, all right. <laughs> Let's not even go there. No, no, please don't. When that comes out, you leave it on the piece of parchment you've got there. Yeah. And then lift it out and then you roll it up so as in you... the parchment when it's warm. OK. So what you get, you get sponge memory. Yes, I see. Like, like a mattress almost. Exactly. Yeah. And as you unroll it, it won't crack because it's got the, the memory in there. Wow. I, I mean, it's, it's, it's... Could I do that like with it's... my script in the morning? If Ben doesn't <laughs> want yeah. but, it, but it might change slightly. So, yeah. so having rolled it once, it's going to be ready to be rolled again once you've stuck the Exactly, and it, it won't crack. Then, what you need to do Very is with a rolling pin, you then just press that slightly... Go the other way. 
Yeah. Just so it compacts that sponge as yeah. well. Because if you look on the one you buy, it's very thin. Yes. So I, I'm, you don't have to do that, I'm just doing it anyway. And then I just jam. Now I'm using just strawberry jam or raspberry jam, it's completely up to you. And lots of jam, in that goes. And mm -hmm. what you need to do is to make sure it goes to the edge. Okay. It makes me really angry when I get a jam roll or I get an up to the, the the jam is not to the edge. Got to get to the edge. Yeah. And being a professional chef, that's the sort of thing that really winds me up. <laughs> <laughs> OK, so it has to be right. OK, then I get ice cream. Now, I buy a firmer ice cream, which is going to come right now. Thank you, Natalie. How Thank do you, you for... know what's a firmer ice cream so, and what's a soft So, what you don't want is the soft scoop ice cream. OK, fine. Right. Because that's not firm enough to hold up. OK. So, I normally buy an ice cream that's in one of those cartons, a cylindrical carton. I won't mention the name. Right. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? So if mm -hmm. it comes in that ready-made ready, ready -made shape, is that what you're saying? No. Sort of, then what you do, but what you, but what you can do is get two of the cartons, take them out and literally push them together, them together. and just press them in cling film and they'll produce that. And that's what oh, it does. Oh, brilliant. Right. So then... Ice cream log. So then what you do is you then roll this up... Oh, with the parchment the again? With the parchment again. And you'll find it will just go to the top. Like so. Oh, look, the jam's he, going everywhere. He makes that look so it easy. Is. It, it, it is. It's and really simple. I just don't think it would be... I'm not a baker Yes, anymore. it's easy. Then what you do is you roll it up again. Right. In, in cling film, back in the freezer. Oh, oh okay, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. That's it. Simple as that. And then it's done. Then it's done. And then what you do, you'll end up with sort of the beauty here. This is one that you made earlier. This is one that you made earlier. You can see that? There it is. Look at that. Just so you can, so you can see where I've delicious. compressed that sponge. And then with a sharp knife, where's my knife gone? I did have a knife here somewhere. All right. We've got. Oi, oi. I, I use a pellet knife. Damien's coming. Damien, good morning. Damien. Oi, oi. Did you sniff the Arctic Roll? I've got to have some of this. I mean, my question is, which hasn't been explained, where do you buy a sausage of ice cream? Well, we, well you just presented he us. Did. You two just, just make it. Push it together. Push it together. Nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I asked the same thing. I didn't know. Yeah. But look, is this, oh. would this be a retro dessert of your choosing or would you have gone jam roly poly? This was, this was, this, the was your head, this was the headline pudding at school. Yes. yes. Same for, same same school. for my book. Absolutely. When, when Arctic go. Roll came out. It was, it was a good day. Yeah, now, we've been a bit of chef here, so there's a bit of raspberry sauce. Uh, so it could be. I've been a while since I had a chip hole for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> this is fantastic. There you go. It's a spoon, I think. I'm being... There you go. There you so, go. there it is. It's, it's very you. simple, but it's about getting the sponge right. Is, was it, is, can I start always? Yeah, yeah, go, yeah go, go, can go, I go, tuck it? Like some, yeah, do it, please. Damien, is this on your rider? <laughs> on, your, on your most recent tour? Yes. It's very <laughs> rock and roll. But mine's mine's, mine's and laced roll. with tequila. <laughs> or oh, could you do that? Of course you can. Yeah. But the trouble mm. with that is it, it softens the ice cream, so be careful. Mm. Oh, mm. So could you and would that. you <laughs> do <laughs> a jam roll the end of the day? Yes. Of course I That's I cold. Of course I Very simple. Oh. Cold. Oh, you're going to put it on sauce. You're going to what? Mm. Sauce. Shall I talk? Anyway, yeah. details of today's recipe, check out the feed this morning. Mm. There you go. That was better than my school's <laughs> Arctic roll, I'll tell you that. Oh, you're a good, decent Absolutely school as well. It is, but it's, that, it's oh, those memories, those retro memories, and school totally. dinners when this came out. Oh, yeah. you're absolutely right. It was the, the mere challenge. Arctic roll under tension. Yeah, yeah. winner, winner, school dinner. <laughs>